Well, today we have a uh, broccoli stew that we're making. The ingredients are half a cup of mushrooms, half a cup of chicken, one fourth cup of onion, and I have two cups of broccoli right here, and a can of cream of chicken. What's important is the garlic. I love garlic. I can use in anything. And also the pepper. And these are the ingredients. This is very easy. So I'm going to teach you how to make a broccoli stew. My own version. And I love this. I like a little bit of combination of a healthy one. Which is the mushrooms and chicken and the broccoli. Broccoli, this is good for you. And I'm pretty sure the kids would love this because... The combination of just the chicken and broccoli is a perfect one. And we will start cooking. Okay, we're going to put one tablespoon of olive oil. The one fourth of a cup of onion. Right there. There you go. That smells pretty good. What I'm gonna do next is one tablespoon of garlic. Right there. Okay, we will just saute them, mix it up, and then once we start seeing the translucent of the onion right here that should be good and ready okay what we're gonna do next is half a cup of mushrooms okay we will just mix it up and Saute them for like a minute or two. What I use here is a uh, portobello mushroom, and this is one of my favorite mushrooms. And you can use them also actually to replace with meat, but if you like combination of mushrooms and meat go for it and you know this is good for you and what I have right here is a cup of chicken and what I did is just slice it in a uh, small cubes and what I did is I put in a little bit of spices on it I put some uh, oregano parsley and basil and um, we're gonna mix it up now there you go And I can already smell the mushrooms and the garlic. Oh, this is just amazing. There you go. Okay, we will just simmer them for, you know, a minute or two. And then we will just leave it that way. There you go. The chicken and mushrooms is simmering up. And I just want them to have a little bit of brown color on the chicken. Just a little bit. So that's going to be one more minute to go. And we'll go for the next ingredient. Okay, the next ingredient that we're going to put in is the two cups of broccoli. Okay, we'll just mix it up very well. Oh, this is this. Smells so good. Amazing. I like the color right there, combination of the chicken and the broccoli.
Now we'll just simmer them for like a minute or two and we will put the cream of chicken next. Now we'll just wait for a minute. And you can already smell the chicken, the mushrooms. Oh, it's just, ooh, it's amazing. It's really good. There you go right there. Okay, we will just mix it up. Okay, what we're going to put in next is the cream of chicken. Since we are using a uh, cream of chicken, I would advise not to put any salt or uh, soy sauce or anything like that because cream of chicken is already salty. So I would just recommend just put the cream of chicken in, you know, just add pepper or whatever herbs that you like. Okay, we're going to put the cream of chicken. We go. We'll just mix it up. There we go. We'll just mix it up a little bit and um, we will be simmering this up for five to ten minutes and it should be should be done there you go guys after five to ten minutes this is what it looks like and you can see right here the bubbles and things like that it's just looks amazing okay well we'll just mix it up Oh, this is just smells delicious. Okay, I like the combination of the broccoli, the chicken, and the mushrooms right here. And I think we're good. And what I'm going to do is just to add more flavor, I'm going to put a uh, pepper. Okay, just sprinkle a little bit of pepper. There you go. This is amazing and pretty much this is done and all we have to do is just do the plating and I'll be right back with you guys. There you go guys. This is our recipe for today. This is a uh, broccoli stew and if you can see the texture right there, this is really pretty good. So once again guys, thank you for watching with my channel don't forget to subscribe and i am pleased thank you very much you have a great day guys here you go enjoy this recipe today thank you very much